What is going on, every pony and pony villain, everybody at Kenzo Lot High and at Crystal Prep? You saw the name, you saw the cutie mark, you your boy Jukebox James on the mic, and welcome back to my little best friends forever month. For the fourth and final week of My Little Best Friends Forever Mind, I'm going to be talking about the number one fashionista in all of Equestria and has her very own boutique in both Ponyville and in Manhattan. But I'm going to personally say that that this little boutique in Manhattan has got to be my personal favorite. I'm talking about the element of generosity herself and one of the most lovable ponies in all of Equestria. It's this little darling right here, Rarity. Look upon me, Equestria, for I am Rarity! Yes, my friends, Rarity is the one I'm going to be talking about today. From the very first time that I heard about her, I think it was in, uh, um, I think it was a dog and a pony show. Oh, man, that was truly tragic. Espe but the one thing that I like about the one thing I, that I like about her is every time, every time she, every time she s says a sentence, she always puts the word "darling" in in her sentences. I just love that quote. Oh my goodness! I don't know what to say except that has got to be my favorite quote of this little mare right here. Oh my god! Oh man! And the element of generosity. I gotta say, she is very generous of what she does for Ponyville, all the pony folk around, around her hometown in Manhattan. Oh man, she's a very hardworking pony. No wonder she's one of the biggest fast, she's one of the biggest fastenistas in all of Equestria. Oh my, oh my goodness. In fact, she was the one who had, who has been helping me with my wardrobe for the wedding. Well, never. We'll never know what my wardrobe is going to look like, but I bet it's going to be pretty sweet. But I bet it's going to be pretty sweet. <sighs> oh my goodness, I don't know, I don't know what to say except, oh, oh man. And, and, some, and some of her um, drama queen segments, oh my good, oh my goodness. You know what? I feel like that she could be a very good actress. With the help of Coco Pomel, Coco Pomel, or I, I don't know how to pronounce her name like that. But anyways, with the help of her, with the help of her, I bet she can make it as a fashionista and an actress. Ooh, let, we'll never know. We'll never know. But I pray that she'll get that opportunity next to being a fashionista. Oh, man. Opening her boutique must be a lot of pressure for her, but I'm... But I'm giving her a thumbs up as a job well done. So, Rarity, what can I say? She's adorable, fashion forward, and somewhat eye-catching to, to every pony everywhere. So, yeah. That, so, yeah. That's what I have to say about, that's what I have to say about Rarity. So, sorry for cutting this short, but how, how, how else can you describe her? How else can you describe her? <laughs> she's just adorable. She's she's just a really good friend to every pony to every pony, no matter where she goes, no matter where she goes, and like she and like and like her element and like her element, she's always generous. Well, don't but one thing in mind though, don't get on her bad side. Yeah. Don't get her on her bad side. I'm serious. Do not get her on her bad side. Well, that concludes My Little Best Friends Forever Month. I'm Jukebox James saying be yourself, be cool, and as always, friendship is magic. Peace out! At the gala of the royals, they will meet fair rarity. They will see I'm just as regal at the gala. At the gala. They will find him, my Prince Charming, and how gallant he will be. He will treat me like a